Good morning, Year Fives, and welcome to your spelling lesson for today. I hope that you've had a really good weekend and you recycle your week or two spelling words. So we're going to be looking at our next 10 words. Um, and these are words that are spelt with the an or the or sound, but we spell them with the A-U letters, okay? So what's going to be really helpful for you today is when we're going through these words, is a good idea is to write them down and then either underline or highlight them or put them in a different color and so that they can really stand out. Okay, so all the AU letters you can highlight or underline so that they really stand out for you when you're learning the spellings of these words. Okay, so we're going to go through these 10 words together now and then at the end there's a challenge um, on teams for you to choose two of these words and write them in a sentence, okay, so that you can, we can see that you have understood the meaning of these words. All right, so we'll go through the 10 words together and then we, you can log on to Teams and do the activity. So let's go through the words now. So the first word we have is pause. Pause simply means to take a break, okay, if you're pausing your video game or your TV program or you're taking a pause from your work, it simply means you're taking a break. The cause is means often to do with um, the cause of something. So it's like the, the result of something, how something has happened. Okay. Um, and so that would be the cause. Sauce, we have tomato sauce, mayonnaise sauce, any type of liquid that we use as a condiment would be a sauce that we, use, we dip in our chips or our um, meat or anything like that that you would have. So sauce. Fraud, if you're committing fraud, it means that you're basically lying about something to steal somebody's money, okay? So if you are fraudulent, you can sort of take the identity of somebody and then you use that to then um, take money from that person. So you're committing fraud. Launch is when we talk about something that's going off. So we talk about like a, um, a rocket launch, okay? So the rocket is going off into the atmosphere, into space. And so if you're launching something, it could, and you could also be like you're launching the ball into the air. It means simply taking off um, into the atmosphere. Author is the person who writes books. It could be a male or a female. August is the month, and that is why it gets a capital letter. It's a proper noun, so that is a very important one to remember when you're doing your spellings today. Is not only must you remember the AU, but you must also remember that August gets a capital letter because it's the name of a month, and all names of a month have a capital A. Not all of them, but all this August will have a capital A. Applaud means to um, celebrate or to clap. Okay, so if you are applauding somebody, it simply means that you're acknowledging them and you're um, clapping for them. Astronaut is somebody who goes up into space. Okay, and we would have learned about astronauts um, in autumn one already, a long time ago now, but um, autumn one, we, when we looked at space in our science topic, we looked at astronauts um, and they are the people that go up into space. And our last word for today is a restaurant, okay? And unfortunately, right now, most of our restaurants are closed and you can't go and eat a meal at the restaurant. You can do takeaways, but you cannot go and sit in them and hopefully they'll be open up soon. So those are places that serve meals. All right, and those are your 10 words for today. So you can log on to Teams now. There are 10 words for you there to practice the spellings of. Um, so read the instructions, it tells you to write them, then say the words out aloud, and then see if you can try and um, write the word without looking at the spellings of it and see if you can get them correct. And then at the bottom is your challenge. So I wish you all the best for your spellings today. I hope you enjoy it and we'll see you back here later. Bye guys.